Now to that chaotic scene in western New York where author Salman Rushdie was stabbed by a man who stormed the stage just as Rushdie was beginning a lecture. Rushdie has faced death threats from Iran for decades. We get more now from CBS's Nikki Batiste. This was the scene shortly before 11 a.m., right after the moment a man was tackled after allegedly stabbing Salman Rushdie on stage just as he was about to speak in Chautauqua, New York. Stephen Davies witnessed the attack. They got maybe 10 seconds into their introduction when an assailant uh, jumped out of the audience onto the stage. He had a black mask and immediately began pummeling Salman Rushdie. 75 year old Rushdie was apparently stabbed in the neck and abdomen. A number of people rushed to his aid. The award winning author was medevaced to an area hospital where he is undergoing surgery. Did the attackers say anything? Not that I heard. Rushdie Rushdie's writings are considered by many Muslims to be blasphemous. His 1988 novel, Satanic Verses, led to the supreme leader of Iran calling for his execution. Rushdie was living with a bounty on his head, now worth over $3 million. You have to defend things you don't agree with. Otherwise, what is free speech if it's only for people that you sort of agree with? Today, police say they are working with the FBI on the investigation. The suspect seen here was identified as 24-year-old Haiti Matar from New Jersey. He had a, a pass to access the grounds just the way any other patron would have. The interviewer who was on stage with Rushdie has minor facial injuries. Authorities would not comment on a possible motive and say they are working to confirm the suspect acted alone. Nancy? So tragic. Nikki Batiste in New York, thank you.